But we still got things to do. As much as it breaks the mood and the flow, we got memories. We need all the skills we can get. There's only two more. You. And you. Uh -huh. Remember first half. Hello? Nobusuma-san, are you here? This place is as humid as always. Not to mention stuffy. Masuma san seems to like being in these kinds of places. Ah! Oh, it's Hakunin. Come to have your energy drained again? N no, that's not it. Today I want to be squeezed out by my chest. Or would you rather use my crotch? <laughs> no, no, that's not why I'm here. Huh, I see. So the other told you to go out and learn from the other yokai. Yes. You know, lots of different techniques, right? If you don't mind, could you teach me something? A technique even a human could use. Hmm. That guy? There's one I can think of. It's one that's simple to train and works well in a pinch. Really? That's kind of convenient a technique exist? Please teach it to me! <laughs> you should know, though. The training is rather harsh. And though it can be learned quickly, that doesn't mean it's easy. R right, of course. I'll still do it. I want to become stronger! <laughs> so then, when do we start the training? You're such a blockhead. It's already begun. Ooh, I, I'm getting a bad feeling. Huh? The exit. <laughs> what on earth are you planning? Gonna trap me inside here? You clearly weren't listening. This is a part of the training. Also, it's not you trapped inside here, but the air. Erik and Yokai energy is being released from my body as we speak, and it's gently draining your human stamina. It's a yokai fragrance designed to weather away your spirit. Keep letting that yokai energy into your body. Keep breathing it in. Do that and you'll be able to comprehend my techniques. My misfortune technique. M misfortune? Uh, <coughs> so in other words... This is a test to see if I can resist to in all the yokai, all this yokai energy? Master's already had me do that. No, you don't get it. You're not supposed to resist. You're supposed to keep breathing it in and absorbing it. You need to get your body accustomed to it. 
do that, and you can turn your yokai opponent's attacks into your power. You convert energy drain attacks into strength. It's like a counterattack. That is the misfortune technique. <laughs> Amazing! Turning attacks into power! Thank you so much, Nobusuma-san! I honestly thought I was about to be dragged into some kind of lewd prank again. You're really going out of your way to help me train! <laughs> you know, before you start learning techniques, I think you should learn to be more suspicious of your opponents. Uh, uh, it's getting harder and harder to breathe. The yokai energy around me is getting quite thick. And again, we are in an airtight space, so that's to be expected. Get hit? Breathing in the yokai energy must be getting you excited. Imagine turning that arousal into energy. Uh, uh, uh. Right. I feel like I'm getting closer to it. Take in yokai energy. Convert it into power. Get <laughs> it? By the way, you heard of stink bugs, right? Who are those insects that let out a strong smell? Huh? Yeah, I've heard of them. What about them? Their smell is a weapon designed to repel predators such as birds. But it's too strong, and it has an effect on even them, too. And so, if you lock one of them up in a jar, they succumb to their own smell and start getting off to it. Quite fascinating, isn't it? <laughs> yeah? But what does that have to do with this? She's getting off on her own smell. <laughs> Because I'm looking forward to what you'll do from here. Will you learn that technique? Or will I be taking care of you before that happens? <laughs> I better quickly learn this technique and get out of here. Yokai Field Guy Nobusuma, a rare yokai. Lurks in places like dark, dank caverns. Repeatedly sheds her skin and evolves into a Yamachichi. Fast on her feet, she can use her membrane to float. Adept with the yokai arts, she's able to brainwash and hypnotize others. Her rough and sadistic personality means she enjoys competition. However, she is also known to open her heart to those she acknowledges as superior. The only one of her kind on the mountain. She lives a happy life with her sister, Yamachichi. But her personality could not be more different from that of her sister's, being far more calculating and clever. She loves competition. Her hunting strategy varies depending on her prey. With males that run erratically in fear from her, she uses her fast body to quickly close the distance and pounce on them. The prey is then wrapped in her membrane, and their strength slowly sapped by her poisonous fragrance. From there, their energy is squeezed out as she amuses herself with her prey's feeble struggling. For prey that is weak of spirit, she uses her sexual wiles instead, flaunting her ample chest and the membrane clinging to her body, along with breathing out copious amounts of sexual miasma to drain their vitality. She easily captivates them. At this point, the prey no longer resists, and she has them indulge in her chest, draining their energy until they are until they're her absolute love slave. However, she is known to approach partners she views as superior, more courtship-like behaviors, being somewhat less rough with them. Remember second half. Uh, uh, concentrate, concentrate, <laughs> can you tell? The 
Yokai energy surrounding us is getting thicker and thicker. There it has become so heavy and sticky, you could almost feel it clinging to your skin. And while you're breathing out, it's going inside my body. That means I can feel what your body is absorbing. Yeah. I can't let myself be seduced. G great! I felt something just now. <laughs> you still haven't learned this technique? No, I just need a little more time. I feel like I've almost got. I just need a little longer. That's so. Then I'll give you a hand. Huh? Hold on. What are you doing? Ah! S stop! Don't get the wrong idea. I'm not attacking you. I'm just helping you. Yokai energy is even thicker inside my membrane, you see. <coughs> oh my, yeah, and it's a new scene, nice. <laughs> you look quite nice without the membrane. I dig it. Now breathe in. Take in the energy. Let my scent fill your whole body. Let it permeate through you. Uh, what do you think? There is a lot more rock in here, isn't it? The warmth of this yokai energy will melt you away. Uh, 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 no, no Busuma san. St stop this! be able to get away from me if you could learn this technique. You could convert all of this yokai energy into power and blow me away from you. But if you can't manage that, <laughs> my hips will end up pushing down against yours if you catch my drift. Now go on. Breathe in this poisonous, humid energy. Let me see how you throw me off. Uh, come on now. Uh, gotta come now. I just need to repeat what I, just, what I did just before. I need to convert the arousal of my spirit to energy. <laughs> yes. You're practically bursting at the seams with it now. With that power in your body. <laughs> It looks like it's all gone straight to your crotch. Huh? Uh. My hips are even a little pathetically starting to buck and twitch. Isn't that a waste of stamina at a time like this? Hurry up and show me how you're going to escape. Uh, uh. Uh, uh, uh. Hmm. Rather than becoming stronger, it seems you're actually relaxing more and more. It's almost like you're no different than any other human. Just another pitiful male destined to be nothing more than a yokai plaything. Uh, I'll get it next time. If you just let me try again. Uh, uh. <laughs> Go on then. Concentrate. You better not think uh, about what's going to happen after you fail. Should you fail, I let the weight of my body drop down, and our hips will be connected. The months are joined, I move my hips up and down. My massive chest will bounce up and down above you. Uh uh. And you'll be able all you'll be able to do is look up at me, helpless to resist. And as your mate into my toy. The bewitching words are throwing my spirit into turmoil. I can't concentrate on mastering the technique. Or the absorbing power. My body is relaxing more and more. Uh, uh, <laughs> looks like it's a little too early for you to learn this technique. But please wait! Just a little more time! No more waiting. 
But don't be discouraged. Failure is how humans learn. And as for today's failure, I'll imprint that bitter memory so thoroughly into you that you'll never ever forget it. Now taste the bittersweet flavor of defeat. Uh, uh, uh. You didn't quite manage to learn misfortune. But I think you'll be able to do it if you can get just a little more spiritual energy. <laughs> now I've got power. I finally understand the meaning behind what she taught me back then. I finally acquired this technique! We got one more. First half. So, to sum up, I like to learn sorcery from everyone on the mountain. Would you mind teaching me something? Huh? Why should I go out of my way to do some anything for you? I'm already even. Huh. Uh, Zuki san. Here I thought we were starting to get along ever since that event. And yet it still feels like there's this big wall between us. I guess I shouldn't be relying on her for this kind of thing. Actually. I changed my mind. I'll teach you a real trump card of mine. What? You will? Thank you so much. Sure will, but only if you beat me. Bring it. Uh, we're going to fight? What, you chicken? I just want to have some fun. Just a little. <laughs> uh, uh, if you're not going to come to me, then I'll go to you! Winley! Yeah! So, so fast! Uh, 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 uh! Come on! You won't win by just running away from me! Uh, uh, uh. <laughs> Damn, Haku, you got your ass beat. <laughs> I know you're tougher than that, come on! <sighs> you're quick on your feet as usual. Uh, but you're duller than you were before. <laughs> I win. Uh, it's frustrating, but she totally beat me. That wind leap made her crazy fast. Huh. Now that we've established the winner and loser, I guess we'll have some fun with my down prey. Wait, it's not the second one, come on! Huh? Strip. Huh? Uh, wh why? We never agreed to that! Why are you playing dumb now? It was obvious we were going to do it. The loser has to do what the winner says. That's the way it works. Uh! Uh, uh, Azuki-san! Wait! Come on, don't be scared, Hakuman. I'm not gonna do anything bad to you. <laughs> ah, 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 Azuki san! St stop it! <laughs> Hakuman. <laughs> I'm gonna really mess you up. Mm -hmm. Uh, my thigh's getting so hot after a hunt. Uh, hey, Hakunin. 
You want me to teach you that win late technique I used to beat you? Ugh! Then you can, uh, then you can come take me on as many times as you want. Our next fight will have the same conditions as this one. <laughs> Surprised we didn't get to see that scene. Yuck, I feel guy. Azuki. A superhuman who's been living on the Horiba Mountain from before Hakuna arrived. Her history is rather peculiar and complicated. Though she lost one of her legs for a certain reason, she can still move quickly thanks to the yokai power gifted to her by the yokai acting as her mo mother, Chiroha. As she's a gifted sniper, she blasts enemies with her beloved gun, given to her by a yokai acting as a surrogate older sister, Professor Sukumo. Because the ammunition she uses is condensed yokai energy, it has no power to kill, instead robbing the target of her vitality. Her first meeting with Hakunin went so poorly that even now there is a lot of awkwardness and tension between them. But her true feelings about him are actually a lot more complicated deep down. Being born under strange circumstances, she's not naturally skilled at squeezing out men. But bullying Hakun seems to get her in the mood and gives a peek into her alluring yokai side. She conceals herself from a distance and uses the magic of vitality drain ammunition from her gun to immobilize her enemy. From there, she leisurely mounts her exhausted prey and has her way with them. Apparently, both her body and spirit are flushed with heat emanating after a hunt, intensifying her lust. According to her, being wrapped up in the ecstasy of victory as she looks down on the prey she's squeezing out it is the moment she enjoys the most. But sometimes, she wishes Hakunin would come seek her out from time to time. Or perhaps she doesn't. <laughs> yep. Born human, raised as a yokai. Remember second half. <laughs> ah! Ha! Ah! Ah! Right. How? To, to think you could seal my whole body like that. Uh, my camera measures worked perfectly. For sealing her legs and keeping a proper distance from her while maintaining my vitality. And after I sealed her big attack and she was paralyzed, switching to seal her tongue, finally activating Provoke to use up all her stamina. Is that a strategy you could use in the, in the previous game? I guess. That was, the perfect, that was the perfect battle for me. If I were getting points for that, it would have been a new record. Ugh. Uh, Azuki-san, we have rematched just as you agreed. And this time I came out the winner. G got it. I lost. Pisses me off, but I'll admit my defeat. Yay! Thanks, Azuki san So you'll teach me a technique, right? That wind leap one? Yeah. Promise is a promise. But there's something I need to do before that. Especially now that our match has been settled. Huh? Something you need to do? Go on. <laughs> Do me! <laughs> huh? Why? What do you mean, why? It's like I told you! The loser has to do whatever the winner tells them. Those are the rules. And you won today. So it's your turn to do whatever you want. No, 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 no! I have no intention of doing that kind of thing! You're such a pain, you stupid blockhead! Just shut up and do it with me already! 
wait a second, Atsuki san! What are you doing? Uh, uh, this'll do. I'll do it with my mouth today. <laughs> well, because we had to block out all that, I'm just going to skip. <laughs> Sorry. Don't apologize. This happened because I lost today. But I'm gonna remember what happened when I went next time. <laughs> oh, whoops! I was supposed to teach you that sorcery. If you quickly follow what I do, you should be able to figure out this its form. When Lee that's even someone like me with a missing leg move quickly. I figure you should be able to learn it. Once you've got some more spirit energy at least. I got power. I finally understand the meaning behind what she taught me back then. I finally acquired this technique! Anything now that we got them all. Can't go in. Got everyone. Can't go up the stairs. So I guess that's it. Might as well use our money. anything else after this. <laughs> 